now with our pet police. I'm certainly spending a lot of time with my dog Walter right now, which he loves. I'm sure you're spending a lot of time with your dog. Plenty of time with Copper. It's also summer, which Walter loves, but it's not all fall fun and games. We need to make sure we're following the summer safety rules when it comes to our pets. Take a look. Good boy, Copper. Our pets love the outdoors, but as the summer heats up, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. our furry friends need to play by the rules. So we brought in trainer Brandon McMillan to help lay down the puppy law. First up, probable pause. Uh, the pads, they cannot take as much heat as what people think. You're wondering why your dog is like kind of prancing. It's actually because their pads are getting burned. Here's how to keep your puppy's pads cool. Find out if the pavement is too hot. You can touch it for 10 seconds without your hand getting burned. It's probably good enough for your dog. Is you always have to keep in mind also that a black top is always way hotter than a sidewalk. Second offense, not enough day drinking. While we can't do a breath test, we can do a scruff test. What I'll do is I'll kind of pull the scruff up like that. Now, if you notice, when I let it go, it goes back right away. That means they're well hydrated. If it doesn't go back immediately, that's a sign of dehydration. So how do we keep them hydrated? Ice cubes are a great way, and you can also do flavored ice cubes. The other thing to keep in mind is the temperature outside. Uh, a lot of dogs are not built for high heat, your huskies, your shepherds. And the third offense, swimming without training. Everyone thinks that pool training means that you're teaching the dog to swim. Your dog already knows how to swim. They're natural swimmers. But they need an escape plan. Put a bowl of treats, teach him to exit on the shallow end because the steps are bigger and much more reliable for the dog to remember. They see the steps right there and they exit and they get the treats. With that, you have the right to remain in summer. Also important for summer safety, properly grooming your dogs. Their coat doesn't just differ by color and length, but some dogs are double coated like huskies and shepherds. The extra layer warms them in the winter, but they'll easily overheat in the summer. So these dogs are meant to be in the heat for too long. Brandon says you want to groom that undercoat completely out. The other thing to keep in mind is some dogs like flat faced dogs like the one I have, they don't do well in the heat anyway, yeah. so you have to be careful with them as well. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.